All right, guys, today I'm going to uh, get the welding helmet. Um, I'm not going to roll it. I'm going to go straight in and see if I can bring the sides in enough to alleviate the stretch. Just test run, see how we do. So bear with me. I'll be right back. Got some new film. Uh, I'm not sure what it is. Pretty cool looking stuff. So I can get you a close-up look of it. It's pretty thick. It's nice and heavy. So I've never dipped it before. Um, not sure how much to activate it or what, but we're all going to kind of learn together. And we'll go from there. Let a little bit of air out. And what I want this to do is actually expand more because my helmet's going to be pretty... It's going to actually take up all of that. So I need to make this blow up. Oh, actually it's one of those. Actually we'll let it open up a little bit. We'll put our activator on it. Ah, okay. Now we definitely got 20 seconds there, so we're going to hit it at 40. I think we got a little crustacean. What is that? It's almost hard. Something in there that's really dense. It's like a piece of plastic or something. I see that bubble over there. That is something in the film there. It looks like paper or something. I've never seen that before, so I'm going to leave it alone and just call it good. It's stretching nicely. It's glassing out nicely. It's going to get in here somewhere. Nothing I can do about that. I'm going to pay more attention next time on my samples here. All right, let's see what we can do here. I'm, just going, to be, I'm going to drop my elbows down. Okay, I got no idea how that rascal turned out. Put my metal there. Okay, slide right through here. Uh -huh. Okay, I did get a couple lines, but there's that thing, <laughs> whatever the hell that is. All right, let me show you guys. And I got my camera down here, so I'll move that out of the way. Okay. Here you go. We got this new film. Really bright. I've got a white backing as you've seen. I've got a couple lines. Where did I see those at? Right here. And then that little thing is right there. Let me see if you can see that. I don't know what it is. It's got to come out of there, but there it is. Oh, it came off. Hmm. Well, I got a little touch up to do there. But anyway, I just wanted to try the film out. Vibrant colors. Very, very vibrant. I don't know if you guys can see that on your end, but wow. And I did get a couple little tiny air bubbles right there. Uh, a little fading, but that can be touched up. Not too bad, really, for the first shot on it. Got some air bubbles right there, too. Uh, we can touch those up. That's not a big deal, either. But the main thing was to show you the film. It's pretty cool. Anyway, this is Dave just testing the uh, tsunami constrictor out. I think some will back the uh, back the hydrovator off just a tad bit. Might have got a little bit too much on it, but it's looking pretty good so far for the first dip. Anyway, tsunami hydrographics just monkeying around as usual. Uh, you guys can uh, go check out my. Uh, YouTube page if you're interested to see some of the crazy stuff we do over here. Anyway, Tsunami Hydrographics, we're out.